What the fuck? What the fuck is this? Hi! What are you? Actually a ghost. Or just some guy. What is that thing in my head? Are you doing this? Why is this happening to me? Talk! Fine, let's do this. Um... What? Boom! Get away from her, you piece of shit! Yeah, I'm numbered, asshole. You shot me! And we can all and we can all use both of our arms. I will personally disassemble you. Oh, jeez, B. Ah! Arr! Are you okay? What are you are such an idiot? What were you thinking coming out here alone? This is all because of me. Oh, I'm sorry. Are you the one putting on a dumb costume and following me around? Kidnapping people, maybe? Is that your fault now? It's in my dreams. Hey, kiddo. We're out here. Outside your head. Whatever's going on in there, I believe you. But I'm not going to let you wander off into the woods to die. Okay. We're all in this now. Even if we weren't, I'd still be out here with you. Me too, obviously. Clearly, clearly we all would be. Listen, I'm all the family my dad has left. I for damn sure I'm not dying out here. And you're... God, you're the closest thing I have to a sister. I don't want you to be gone. So you're not dying either. That sounds okay. By me. Well, he's wounded. Sounds like he went back to the mine. Yeah, what do we do? Follow him, I guess. You all wait here. I'll go. <laughs> Why would any of them listen to that? <laughs> anyway. Yeah, anyway. If he's up in the mine, we might be able to corner him and tie him up. Or something. Can you walk me? I, I think so. Might be a little slow. I'll help you if you need it. Thanks, big guy. All right, let's go do something really stupid. I <laughs> love my friends. Gates open. Oh, jeez. But we could like block it shut or something. Oh, dang. You're right. No. I have to go down in there. Well then, looks like all of his friends are gone. Just one guy. Just one guy. Just one something. Bang, bang. Gonna figure out what all this bullshit is. <sighs> I'm ready to find out what all this is. I am ready. This is... Oh, I'm so... So tense. What? <laughs> oh. I was like, what the fuck? Well, this isn't dangerous. Well, this isn't dangerous or anything. <laughs> Nothing to be scared of down here, just a party. <laughs> Not too late to throw ourselves into traffic instead. Hello? There's a switch. I'm afraid to pull the switch, and I don't think I will. Ah, fuck it. I think I'm going to pull the switch. I have to pull the switch. Looks like you took the elevator down. So much for the element of surprise. You can hear us coming a mile away. Are you sure we want to do this? Yeah, mate, you sure? Guys, I don't know if you understand. <laughs> He's in my head. It can't function like this. Everything is dying or dead already. I, I don't know what's going to happen down there. Okay, then. We'll come out of this together. This is getting into some, like, it level territory. Like... 
Ugh, that thing looks old. They haven't used this mine in like a lot of years. Generations even. Are you our tour guide now? Come on guys, let's get going. We are down to go. We have Possum Springs tourism pamphlets at the shop. And I get bored. This is the brochure. This is in the brochure. <laughs> well, here we are. Me? You okay? I have my inhaler. No, I'm fine. It's just like... It's like something huge is on top of me. I mean, technically you're not wrong. Is it like asthma? It's how asthma is. It's not asthma, big guy. But thanks. Shh! I hear something. Down there. Gonna be okay, May? Yeah, I'm alright. We should be quiet. Yeah, gotta save up for the screaming later. <laughs> oh, I hope everyone's okay. I don't know what kind of game this is, but I don't want anyone to die. I love everyone. Oh my god. What is this? What is this nightmare of a tunnel? Stop. Stop yawning. Door. Door. Tunnel? Whatever. Here we go. Who the hell did we shoot? Seriously. Where did where did Greg get a crossbow? We, of course Greg has a crossbow. I'm not even going to pretend that that doesn't surprise me. Hello? Ghosty dude? Ah, jeez. What is this place? Looks like a church or something. And like junk. Oh, God. Oh, God. What is it? It's here. It's here. Oh, God. What is it? I don't know, but it's here. It's through here. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Alright, whatever is going on, my friends come first. If this is one of those games, we our friends come first, May. I don't like this. I know you're in here. Say something. Well, how about this? Take a couple more steps forward if you want to die. Show yourself. Yeah, asshole, we're like five times scarier than you. There they are. They're right there. I'm gonna kill them. And you'll do no such thing. It's out of your hands now. He shot me. I'd say we're even. The girl got shot the other night. Yeah, sorry about that. You're apologizing? It's a bad call. I'm sorry. It's okay. It actually hit me, so... Wait. What? <laughs> Who are you? Bunch of old boys doing their damnedest to protect their own and the neighbors. Th then why are you trying to kill me? Kill you? Nobody's gonna kill you. All of you are part of this town. By family nation and just being hard workers. Contributors. Um, okay. So we could just leave? Well, he brought you down here for a reason. He's not gonna let you leave until he's had his say. Well, he's already got an arrow through his shoulder. I don't think he's gonna be having much say in whatever. Wait, so you think that Edie? He kidnapped that kid at Harfest. Harfest. He's he's been in my head somehow. I'm always tired, constant headaches, and he's been following me following all of us. He Oh, little girl, you don't know what this is, do you? 
What? Oh, God. I've seen this. I've I felt it. it. Was Ed Scudder and Jim Dorn who found it? Twenty years back or so, to the West Mine closed out past Brittle. That Schumacher, last supervisor, supervisor, is out there when the company locked off the entrance, carved its initials and date in the door. Then you got this mine, the old one. Not even a proper mine. Big hole, copper. Abandoned, cheap, long before any of us were born. Too close to water. And that water was poison. When the first settlers came out here, yeah, that old spring used to be right above where we're standing. But that water dried up. 1992 or so, some men from West Mine come back here to try bootlegging. Practically built a new elevator, got the main tunnel cleared. Never found no coal, just dug deeper and deeper. Till Ed busts through this wall and finds this place. Jim walks right into that hole. Never hits bottom. Ed calls down to Jim. Jim don't answer. Someone else does. I know you heard that voice, girl. In dreams and awakened times. That's what brought you down here. What is it? Black goat. Not even black like the color. Black like the space between stars. He's down there in that hole, looking up at us right now. He don't talk to you. He sings. Why would you just do something a hole? Why, why would you just do something a hole in a cave told you to do? Gotta understand. In those days, it was the end of the world. Jobs gone, our kids were leaving. Government didn't care, only wanted our votes. Just putting in more regulations, sending our jobs overseas. Spending our taxes on lazy people and immigrants. While we worked ourselves to death. This is getting a little, uh... Ugh, here we go. God damn, I hate this crap. You old dipshits. You finished? Yeah, sure. We prayed and prayed up at the church, but when Ed Scudder came back down here and listened, he got answers back. Oh, God, I think I know. Yeah, he's already in there singing to you, right? I, I... Ed explained it to a few folks, and they didn't believe it. But he was persuasive. He had the glimmer. The glimmer? One's to take a shine in two. Rubs off on you. He could do things. I never seen it. They said Ed could walk through walls. Okay. Dread talked us into all this. That first time after we picked one out. Well... Not only was the town holding stable, it's almost like we were getting younger and money came too. Still a few of us left from, from back then. Picked? First one was Tom Turner. Who, believe you me, was a bastard. Just pure trash. We got him down here, and in the hole he went. Next week, flowers blooming all over the hills. You throw them in the hole? They're feeding him. He's hungry like you wouldn't believe. Every few months or so, he starts singing. And it's someone's turn to find someone. Was that what you were doing the other night? No. What happened the other night was a shame. One of our number broke the rules. Had to pay up. That was a hard thing to do. I think I'm gonna be sick. We never picked none who's gonna be missed. That's a solid rule. Drifters, drunks, and delinquents. You've been... Oh, God. Oh, no. Casey? That hardly kid? All he's gonna contribute to society except a bunch of kids grow up with no dad. It was a rap sheet a long mile. For whatever sad end he'd wind up at, we did him a favor. Y you... You... Killed, Casey? Oh my god. We don't use that word. You know he was taking up business with his cousin, right? You know what happened to his cousin? Burned alive when his little trailer lab exploded. They had to wear hazmat suits when they cleaned him up. That's where Casey was headed. You killed Casey! You want to act like we didn't do him in this whole town a favor? 
Oh god, Casey's been down here the whole time. His parents put up posters! Maybe they should have cared more about him before it came to this. Which one of you did it? Greg. He was my friend! Alright now, throw it down right now or I will shoot. <laughs> what if I get you first? Bolt sticking right out of your eye. Bang! Bang! You brought guns down here? Dangerous is far out in the woods and not basic safety. I... I... Throw it down, son. Don't make this our time. Greg. Dang it. We're monsters. None of this. None of this is happening. We are not the monsters. We do it because we love our home. As long as we keep doing this, Possum Springs survives. Things can get better. These mines are going to be humming again someday. Old mills puffing smoke. You kids don't understand that. We lost what our world was built around. Used to be provided for a family, bought a house. Now you're stocking shells at a grocery store. Kids leaving more than they stand, no opportunity here. Old people dying, houses left empty. You ever seen that? A home become a pile, then a tumbled in pile of wood and plaster. Job become a burned out brick box or a hole in the ground. But we can change that. We can put this place back together. Where it won't just be. Shapes. I'm going to die down here. Why are you telling us all this? Because we're getting old. And even with the fringe benefit of good health, we need new blood. Carry this on when we're gone. Really, you're like pitching us on this. Were any of you even miners back in the day? Any Are any of you hurting now financially like? Or is this just some big costume party murder club? For someone's shitty boss is afraid of dying. That don't matter. <clears throat> it does. This is real bad. This is insane. Why shouldn't we just call the cops? And say what? Saw some man you can't identify in an abandoned mine behind the lock gate? Elevator that won't run? But you saw a hole? Okay, fine. Why should we help you? Because if no one is here to do this... Remember that flood a few years back? Remember the blizzard in 2010? That's what happens. And beyond that, jobs never come back. The kids never come back. Everything crumbles. Possum Spring bleeds to death. And soon we'll all be dead. And this town will just be fields and trees. I've seen it. I know you have. I'll understand if you need some time to think it over. So we can leave? No one's gonna stop you. Understand that you don't know who we are. Out there. But we know who you all are. Ain't fair they get to leave and I probably got permanent damage. Shut it, Edie. You don't know a thing about what he wants. What he is, Edie, I swear to God. Let's go. Yeah, let's seriously get out of here. Son, you leave that crossbow. What? Why? Well, I could bullshit you. But the truth is, I just don't trust you. Fine, whatever. It's a piece of shit anyway. <laughs> I, I can't move you guys. I'll carry you. Holy shit! I have no idea what to even think about any of this. It's just horror. That's not a word you get to use too often. It's all I've got left. Like, everything else in my head is gone. Let's get out of here fast. I don't know if I... Shh. Talk later. 
old, old stuff in here. What the fuck? How the hell do I... How does this end in any good way? Okay, I'm gonna have to put you down for a sec, okay? Okay. So, Casey... Yeah. I... Yeah. And for what? I, I think I get it. Wow, really? Too tired to explain it, right? But, like... They lost what they thought was gonna happen. Which was what had happened, like, a long time ago. Or how they remember it, or, like, picture it. Things it gave them. It's like Casey and that kid at Harfest, and... Sorry, I lost it. That's more sense than I can make of it. They're sad. It's all really sad. You ready to go again, Angus? Yeah, I'm sorry. Wait, everybody shut up. What? Shh, I thought I... What is... Pull the lever! Pull the lever! Pull the lever and Oh, what the fuck? Oh my god! Oh my god! Holy... Holy shit! Is everyone okay? M May, May, are you okay? Me, say something. <laughs> Me? <laughs> it's okay. It's okay, I've got you. He's gone now. Shit, how are we gonna get out of here? Shh, give her a minute. feel air coming in from somewhere. So we're not gonna suffocate. Okay, well that's a relief. How do you... I was a scout, Greg. I was a scout. Hey, Angus. Yeah? I love you. Aww. Welcome back, May. You okay? Better now that I almost got murdered. Again. Which is weird. <laughs> that was like the third time in two days. Third time, third time's the charm, guys. The air's coming from back here. All right, I'm up. You sure? Yeah, I think I can walk at least. It's boarded up a long time ago. Can we get through? Let's find out. Let's get out of here. That was me. That Yay! Yep, that's some fresh air, all right. <laughs> and water. Dude, that is amazing. You can smell water? Hopefully it's not a river. Cave rivers are death traps. Mine river? We're in a mine. Right. Oh, I can, I can move! Yeah, I can move at a free pace again! Huh. I could see the bottom? I don't think we're gonna die in the one foot of water. Right. No! What the fuck? What the fuck? I know what you are now. I, I think I knew before. But, you know, after I sent that kid to the hospital years ago, they said I had an anger problem. But that's not true. It's angry because of something else. Something I'd lost. Trying so hard since not to be angry. Got me all defenseless. I lost more and more and more. That's not getting better. I want to be angry. 
When I ran home from college, on the bus I had this dream. Maybe I saw it out the window. Last leaf on the tree, finally blown off. I'm so scared. All the time. And the fear hurts. I feel like everything is over. It was over long before I got here. So long hiding or trying to outrun this. I get it. This won't stop until I die. But when I die, I want it to hurt. My friends leave when I have to let go. When this entire town is wiped off the map, I want it to hurt bad. I want to lose. I want to get beaten up. I want to hold on until I'm thrown off and everything ends. And you know what? Until that happens, I want to hope again. And I want it to hurt. Because that means it meant something. It means I'm something at least. <laughs> Pretty amazing to be something at least. Yeah, all right. You know I can't understand you, right? Oh, shut up already. I know this won't save me in the end, but I don't need it to save me forever. I just need it to save me now. So if you're going to kill me right here, then do it. If not... Me. Dude, you okay? Oh. You got all sleepwalky there for a second. You want me to carry you? No, I think I'm good. I'm just very, very tired. Hang, hang here for a bit if you need to. We're safe. Nah. Uh, hey, there's lead over there. You smell that? I bet he did. I don't know what the fuck is happening. But I'm okay, you know what? I, I, I accept. What is this? Might be a vent or something. Keep the miners from suffocating way back then? Looks old enough at least. Brochure. Hello! We're down here! Don't ask us why, please! Could get lucky and someone out there in the woods tonight. I, I can try to make it out. No, I can, like... Okay, yeah, you up for this? Yeah, I don't know. I'm, like, all hyper now. Like, dolphins. Hyper like dolphins? No, like, when your body is, like, uh, whoa, I almost died, and you get all hyper because you're filled with dolphins? Okay, I'm seriously confused. Are you okay, May? Endorphins. Ah, okay. There, thank you, those. Okay, well... Ride those dolphins up out of here. Uh, that's assuming I can even do this. We'll watch. Okay. I got this. Don't worry, guys. I'm gonna save the day. I played some... I played some goddamn Metroid in my time. I know how this works. Gotta speed through. Yes! Oh, it's an old well. Ha ha! I have escaped. <laughs> this place, huh? Hey, May! Germ? Yeah! What are you doing out of here? I live right up the hill. I heard Greg yelling. We were all stuck down there. You're at the bottom of the old well in my backyard? It's been a really bad night. Sounds like it. Any hey, rope or something? Yeah! C can you can you go get it? <laughs> hey, May! Yeah? Was that Germ? Yeah, he's getting some rope. What is he doing out here? He lives here. In the woods? <sighs> My entire body hurts. That was a long way. I brought some sodas. You're the best, Germ. You need the sugar and caffeine. Uh, anyone else want to get far away from this well? Yup. Germ, can you, like, I don't know, seal up this well? Uh, 
I got dynamite. What? Yeah, I mean, I can get some. How big an explosion is that? I mean, not small? Okay, that works. Thanks, thanks, Jerem. Yeah, thanks, buddy. Um, okay. Bye, guys. There goes a weird, weird guy. He saved our lives. Jerem is good. Jerem is a good man. He's got the dynamite right now, doesn't he? Strikes me that we just murdered all of those dudes down there. How do you figure? Well, I mean, the elevator's broken and we caused a cave-in. That was self-defense. I guess, but we did cause the death of, like, a dozen guys. No, 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 they're still alive down there. Oh, God. Yeah. Jeez. Well, we're blameless. They attacked us. One of them attacked us. So we're worrying about, like, it's morally gray. We're not murderers. Like, if we'd had a choice, we wouldn't have done it. I would have. Uh, what? They, like, killed people. They were trying to get us to kill people. Screw them. I don't even believe in hell, and I hope they all go straight there. Jeez, Angus. Well, that's what I think, at least. It's just like that trolley thing. What trolley thing? Okay, I'll explain it if we keep walking. <laughs> Alright, so they're all stuck down there, and they can throw themselves into feed the fucking devil thing. Whatever, fuck them. Hey, guys. Uh, are you there? Anyone? Okay, I'm gonna type anyway. Hard for me to say anything smart about what the hell even just happened. Easier for me to get it all out here. But I need to talk. I need a few jerks off doing whatever. None of us asked for any of this. And it didn't happen to us because we're, like, special. You can work as hard as you want, but the universe is going to keep doing what it does. And I don't think any of us deserved all this. It's all stuff that started long before we were born. It's all like moving so fast and you're dropped into it and you're just trying to grab onto something. All of you are what kept me from floating off tonight. Also, you kind of killed that guy to save me. I don't think I don't don't think I don't appreciate that. <laughs> I don't know if I'm ever going to understand what all just happened. I hope it stopped. I just feel right now like all I want to do is wrap my arms around all of you and just not because I love you. But I want to keep you all together with me. Wrap up into a ball and no one can hurt us. Sorry, I'm rambling. Germ, buddy. Germ, you don't even use Messenger. But I guess I'm just typing at you wherever you're at. B, you're definitely something. I'm so sorry about all you've gone through. I don't even understand all your problems, but if I could, I'd fix them. Fix all of it. I'd buy the tools to do it from your store. Like, borrow them at least. Better friend would buy, but I'm what you got. I'm glad. Yeah, there it is. Now I'm just gonna erase all that. Oh shit. I was just kidding a lot about that. I'm really tired. I don't know what I'm saying. Log off, log off, mate. Log off. <coughs> is that it? I can't stop now. <laughs> They're all going to be there. It's good to be alive this morning. That's all. Hey, man. Nice messages last night. I mean, like, really. Y you massive dork. Band practice today. Because I feel like if we need to do something normal, I'm at the snalkin'. Hope you're feeling okay. Sincerely, Gregory. Hey, May. Are you okay this morning? I'm not opening the pickaxe today. Greg informs me during brand practice, though. I'll see you there. <laughs> not opening, opening the... We're doing brand practice. I'm... Uh, words. Oh, I'm just so happy everything's okay. I'm just so happy everything's okay. Epilogue! 
Log. I love everyone so much. I love Greg's silly arm wiggling. It's us. Just us. Home and us. I don't know what this feeling is. But I'm not going to cry today. We're going to eat you for Thanksgiving, bird. <laughs> Alright, I guess we're going to eat bird. May, honey, is that you? Yeah. I'm back in the kitchen if you want to talk. Of course I want to talk, Mom. You're the best. Hey, sweetie. Hey, Mom. How are you feeling? Good enough to jump up here. Can you do me a favor and stay home tonight? Sure. I... You're an adult, and you can do whatever you want, but you do live here, and you are still my baby. Aw, Mom. We need to come up with some ground rules, just because, honey, you could have died the other night. And you just left to hang out with your friends? I... I... I'm so sorry, Mom. Sweetie, what's going on with you? I've had a really tough year, Mom. Hunt, you've had a tough week. We all have. Yeah, but... What happened at school, Hun? I don't care what it is, just please tell me. Are you working today? No, me and your father are both off today. I'll be around tonight. We can talk about it then? Sure. We can make breakfast for dinner like we used to. Dad can flip the pancakes in the air! <laughs> sure. Are you going out today? Yeah. Can you please stay in town, close? Yeah, Mom. I think they're getting some of the longest night decorations out. Oh, wow. Calling for some snow, too. That went fast. What did? The fall? Always does, hon. Okay. Well, I'm off. I love you, sweetie. I love you, too, Mom. Are you still reading the same book? Oh no, this is a different one. This one's about people who died in the mines around here. Oh, cool. Yeah, it's very interesting. It's got some old songs. Wanna hear one? Sure. Far from here, the ocean's roaring. Far away across the din. I hear the Lord call the children. Bringing in, bringing in. I'll see you walking through the barley. We'll find each other, friend and kin. I hear the Lord call the children in. Bring them in, bring them in. Tarry with me for a moment. Talk the places we've been. The Lord will call us both to heaven. Bring them in, bring them in. That's nice. It is, it is nice. I love you, Mom. Everything feels nice. Oh, Dad! Hey, Dad. No work today? I told Bob to shove it. Really? No. <laughs> you okay? Yeah, I'll be fine. Not gonna sugarcoat it. I hate my job. Oh, Dad, why? I've mined. I've made glass. I've done a heap of other stuff. This place, they just don't respect you for working. They don't? Job's supposed to pay you enough to live. Job's supposed to let you provide for your family. Job's supposed to have regular hours. Boss is supposed to respect you. Worker's supposed to be able to talk. Worker's supposed to be able to have a life. Worker's supposed to be able to live. Mom always had to work, but I wanted to give you and her your time. I wanted her to have hobbies. And enough time and money to do them. That's what made me happy. Now I just work so I can keep our health insurance and hold on to the house. Try to, at least. Is there anything you can do? I mean, we do need a union. It's just easier to say it than get it done. Unions were always there in the mines and the factory, at least for a while. Here? I got something for you. Got it out of the basement. How'd you get in the basement? Door in the crawl space. That's spooky. So what I got is a tooth. A what? You know what this tooth is? No. Really? You sure? Yeah, Granddad must have had it from the old days. May, thank you. Wow, it looks bright and new. Just pulled it out of skull yesterday. You show that to your boss and tell him to eat shit. 
May. Sorry. I'll just keep it with me. Sure thing. May? Yeah? You come down and pick it with us if we walk out. I will breathe fire, Dad. I love you, kitten. Be back later, Dad. I'm so glad that tooth did something. What are you doing out here, by the way? Getting an early start on our longest night lights plan. Gotta dig them out of the closet. See if they even work still. Help you put them up? We'll see. You're a small fry. Dad. Dum-de-dum-dum-dum. No, I don't even want to ruin anything. It's too nice a day. <laughs> too nice a day to mess up their mailboxes. Selmers! Hey, man. What's up, Selmers? You, you okay? After the whole, like, head injury thing? Yeah, I'm alright. Headaches is all. Got some migraine meds if you need it. Nah, it's not a migraine. Those things make you have to pee. It's the caffeine. If you ever take pills that make you pee, it's the caffeine. I didn't know that. I used to work at the pharmacy. Alright. Well, if I ever have a headache or need to pee, I'll come by. Anytime, neighbor. Snow coming. Gonna be bad this year. Boink, boink. And Mr. Chazakov! Hey, May. Hey, Mr. Chazakov. Got any more Dusk Stars we can look at? One more. And I did it again. Ooh, let's found it. Let us consult the guide. The Fire Maker. The Fire Maker? A wanderer in the cold and dark, making a fire and leveling up to it. For light and warmth. Sounds festive. Sounds like survival. Hmm. The star makes me want to cry. Crying on my roof? Do you wish to talk about it? His accent has changed so much. No, it's fine. It is a happy cry or a sad cry. I don't know. I don't have great words for it. It is okay. Sometimes too many words. Yeah. Thank you for this. Thank you for joining me. I think we have discovered them all? Well, we didn't really discover them, right? I mean, someone else already saw them and named them. Wrote a whole bunch of stuff about them, and we just, like, found what they made for us. Is that not the discovery? Not really. Maybe not in the historical sense. We did not create the stars. Or name them. But we had these autumn afternoons, and found them together. Isn't that something? Something, something, something. My granddad said something like that once. Something about a story having really happened because hearing it happen to you. That is nice. It's not bad. Yay! We got all of them! Yay! So what now? Super Moon is coming. What is that? Giant the Moon! Ooh, that does sound super. You must come meet me when it happens. It will be late at night. There will be others on the roofs. You come, I will make hot chocolate. What a time. Sounds great. I want to see a super moon. Plan not. See you later, Mr. Chazakov. See you soon, Stargazer. I'm missing some stuff, but not a lot. Boom, boom, boom. This place is lovely. I'm so happy to be here. Everything is so beautiful when there's not a creepy cult fucking invading your brain every night. I think. <sighs> Poor Casey. Oh, can I talk to the teens or the, uh... Oh, fish guy. When winter come and water freeze, there fish can be at ease. The tunnel is not flooded, run. It's a home, a place for doing. Sure that works. 
Please go away. My precious rat babies left the nest. They go up so fast. Yep. Yes, they do. Anything over here? Any teens? Teens! Yes! Hello, teenagers! Yeah? Stay safe, alright? Wow, thanks, Mom. Are you our new mom? Apparently. Life, man, it goes. Slowly. Nah, dude. Nah. These kids are nice. Man, I love everything about all this stuff. Everything's great. Everything's grand. I got the whole wide world in the palm of my hand. Everything is perfect. I'm gonna stop now before I start actually singing. I got a I got a band practice for that. Hey, mom's not here, but I still want to see if somebody else is over here. Pastor lady, I love you. You're not here. Did the si Oh, what if they were all the city council? Was one of the city council named Edie? I swear they were. He'll look a lot friendlier when he's covered in snow. Hey. Well, hey there, May. What are you doing? Oh, just cleaning up. How'd the council vote go? We lost. I lost. It was just me pushing for it, really. We've got all this empty space. Could use it for so many things, but... We tried. All we can do. And God will show up when the time is right. Bruce was my friend. Mine, too. Bruce was my friend, too. You need some help cleaning this place up? That'd be nice, May. There's a rake back in the shed behind the church. Oh, I can't do it now, but... <laughs> Run along, May. Bye. Are the, are the weird teenagers over here? I love them. They're some of the best. Nope. But it's nice here. Man, this game was so much fun. I don't... I, I don't think I've had, like, this much fun in forever. I, I've never been into a... Well, I can't say I've never, but, like, the last time I was into a game this much, it was, like, Undertale. And I literally just streamed the entire thing all the way through on stream. Well, like, 70% of... No, more like 90% of it all the way through. It was so much fun. It was so great. And just like... This is so fantastic. I'm so happy with this. There's like a great... A great weird story here. Come on. You can do it. There we go. We gotta talk to Lorem. Our little mouse friend. Mouse friend, mouse friend, hello, Lorem. I am here. Hey, you okay? Hey, I heard you were like in the hospital or something. Yeah. What for? I fell into a ravine while running through the woods at night. Why? Um, chased by a death cult, death cult of conservative uncles. All right, you don't have to tell me. So you're really okay? Yeah, it's just been a weird few days. Okay, I got worried. Oh, I'm super tough. Nothing's gonna get me anytime soon. Oh, good. That's good. I wonder if they'll ever figure out who messed up the dudes. 
The dudes? The mural in the tunnel. Oh, I did that. What? Why? I don't know. That's not a reason. Why do you care so much? The dudes! The dudes are sacred! Why? They're like a part of this place. I mean, this entire place is really messed up and nobody cares. I want someone to notice things aren't okay. This town is like a horror movie that never stops. Not even a good one. Yeah, it might suck. It's our horror movie. That's kind of cool, right? Yeah, but... Yeah, I know. I have the same thing inside of me. The thing. The thing. I feel like no one cares. Everything just sucks forever. There's thing, thing coming. For, there's something coming for us, happening to us. Yeah, but like, this isn't advice I'm good at taking, but sometimes things are big enough and bad enough that they're unkillable. But, you know, life goes on. Yeah, that's not really comforting. <laughs> well, I'm still working out a better pep talk for myself, too. Fair enough. You know, does your family do stuff for the holidays? My dad's usually away on Thanksgiving, but he's home for the longest night. You should come do Thanksgiving in my house. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on. We have four chairs and there's only three of us. The other chair usually just has junk on it. No, 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 I can't. Why not? <laughs> it, it's fine. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Hey, okay, we can talk about it later. <sighs> Thank you. Are you okay? Can I do anything? No, it's cool. I just need to sit here and be quiet for a while. Okay, I'll leave you alone then. See you tomorrow, probably. May? Yep. Thanks for hanging out with me. No prob, kid. Trying to, like, burn something down in the meantime. <laughs> See ya. I love Lorem. Lorem is great. Uh, let's check on Duck Dude one more time. Ah, fuck. Duck Dude. What's going to happen to all this? I guess it's just going to sit here. Someone gets around throwing it all out? I should, like, steal the good stuff. See what Mom and Dad think. I'm sure they'll love it. Decorate the living room. That'd be a good idea, actually. All my rat children are gone. My babies have left the nest. Well, nothing to do here with... I don't remember his name. I just call him the duck. Hmm. I guess B's not at work. Go see how Angus is doing. Do, 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 do. Oh, so can I go in here? Nope. Hey! Hey, it's you! Yep, yep. Now at least. You know, I never got your name. I'm the janitor. I clean up, do fix-its. Never needs done. Oh, okay. So what's it been like being home again? Things like you remember them? Kinda. I don't know. I don't even remember today. Sounds like you've been through something. How'd you know? Called experience. I swear some mornings I feel every bit as old as these trees. You know, something big did happen. I feel like I should have woken up today and, like, have learned something. But I don't know if I learned anything, really. Well, my experience is big things don't teach you anything. They make you something. Sometimes you gotta wait a while to see what comes of it. Huh. Well, done an honest day's work. Quitting time. Smelter's game tonight. See you around. Not if I see you first, May. <laughs> Bye, dude. Wait, how did you know my name? Also, I thought that raccoon in the background was the baby carriage. Mr. Janitor, Lord Janitor, Bob Janitor. Get a job as janitor and really enjoy it. That would be cool. I, I feel like people who enjoy cleaning would be okay with that kind of job. Like... Just clean. <gasps> Tacos! 
Can I go into the porn section yet? Fuck! There's no one here who can't go in the goddamn porn section. But at least there's tacos. At least there's fucking... Holy crap! Ah, taco plates! This is the best thing that's happened in this town since... We got internet. We were still using Cyberfish until like two years ago because it's eternally two decades behind here. Takes you three days to torrent a movie. Takes you one day to load a GIF. Barbaric times. God. Life moves on, huh? Oh my god, they deliver. I'm gonna eat the shit out of some tacos. Hello. So you're a taco dude now? I mean, I was hired to be a taco artisan. But I guess that means holding the sign out in the snow. It's not really snowing that hard. It's snowing. There is snow in the sky falling. How are the tacos here? Good. I like tacos. There's not one person on God's earth who doesn't love tacos. Bad news. My ex hates tacos. Good news. They're now your ex. <laughs> Have fun with the tacos. Yeah, it pays. Taco buck. Dine in, dine out. We deliver. Please tip your delivery persons. Best tacos in all the general region, pretty sure. Best missing, been missing the pizza place? Want to try a pizza taco? Oh, wow, that sounds amazing. Watching your health? Try out the all lettuce taco. No, I refuse. Get out of here, kid. I'm working. <laughs> what the hell? Wait, where's... Where did other guy go? Who are you? Haven't you seen me around? Nah. Well, I've noticed you. That's not weird or anything. A bit cold for standing outside, isn't it? Someone's gotta stand here. Hey, you a Smelters fan? Um, yeah. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. Go Smelters? Go Smelters! Go Smelters. Heck yeah. Heck yeah, smelters. Alright, well, so I think that other guy was part of the conspiracy and he's dead now, so that's good. Or he's not dead, he's just trapped in, in there until they have to start either throwing people in the thing or eating them. Greg, you're the coolest friend ever. Well, look who's alive and well. Is that a surprise? Nah, just seems like relevant. Well... Ugh, I'm dying. Well, look who's live. Look who's live and well, you too. Yeah. Yeah. You want to get out of here? Do band practice? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Let's band practice the shit out of this. God, this door just does not like to open. Bet it's worse in the summer. So did you all get keys to the back door? Greg got one and we made copies. How do you even get a key? I have no idea. Where's Greg? Oh yeah, you just bring Angus from work. What does that mean? Zero clue. Huh. I'm a little unclear about how both of them still have jobs, since they seem to just up and leave work early a lot. There's a lot about those two I don't understand. I think they just plain need each other. Greg more than Angus, I think. I don't think Angus would agree. That's because it would occur to Ang wouldn't occur to Angus to think otherwise, because Angus is an extremely nice person. Greg's a nice person. Oh yeah, he definitely is, but he's also bratty and irresponsible and has like zero attention span. Greg needs a parent as much as he needs a boyfriend. He's really lucky Angus is a little bit of both. Angus thinks Greg, like, saved him. Listen, I'm not saying he didn't, if he thinks so. Angus might also just be attracted to really sincere guys in leather jackets. Who carry knives? I mean, if I met the right guy, those would all be pluses. Gee, you've thought this out. Before you came back, they were the only people I hung out with most of the time. I had a lot of time to study. So, like, how are you? I'm good. Really? I feel like right now I could convince myself I was fine or completely shattered, just like stuck in neutral. 
You? Um, not great. Had a dream the world was ending? Might be. You think we're safe? No idea. Great feeling. Yep. So, like, I'm a little confused about what even happened last night. Well, there's apparently a death cult of dads. Or was. Who knows if that was all of them. Can't believe they even exist or existed. Probably take them a few days to die. <laughs> yep. I don't know. I kind of understand them in a weird way. Really? It's like porch light that's on. And then there are all these bugs around it. Then the light goes out. There's a hole where the light was. It's like what happened to me back way. Like I was telling you about on the couch last night. Holy crap. That was last night. Seems like two lifetimes ago. Yeah. Kiss, 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 kiss. God, I can't even wrap my head around these past two weeks. That's pretty understandable, May. There's this kid, Lori. And I'm like, uh, maybe trying to be a role model? How old is she? I think 15 or so? So you're just hanging out with a 15-year-old? Oh, shut up. Anyway, just this thing where she puts little metal dudes on the train tracks, like squishes them together, and makes these rad little monsters. Oh, huh, that sounds cool. Yeah, it's awesome. It also made me think, like, if they were alive when it happened... God, that's grim. If they were just destroyed and crushed by a massive unknowable thing and crammed into being one thing, they're like a new monster. Twice the monster, even. Like me and the Fort Lucene Fish God. I think you actually injured a few of those people. Eh. Anyway. But like, look at where we live. Big giant things roll over this place. And I don't know if it, know if it made us all stronger or just made some monsters. I think it did both. Like, anything traumatic on that scale does both. But as much as I hate this shithole sometimes, it's home. Remember when Mrs. Krangler taught us to square dance in Girl Scouts? Yeah, jeez, she had that stick. Yeah, she'd hit the ground to the beat. Mrs. Krangler was some serious about square dancing. She died recently, I guess. Yeah, she was extremely old, though. Square dancing was weird. All of us just jumbled up, trying to dance, trying not to trip over each other. Mr. Krangler is dead, but the square dance rings lives on. I wonder if Lori knows how to square dance. We should teach her? Oh, am I being drafted in this makeshift sisterhood? Sisterhood of square dancing monsters? We'll rule the floor at the State Farm Show. We'll rule any floor we lay our eyes on, thank you very much. So, have you had any new uh, rat problems at the shop? Uh, yeah, how did you know? I heard there were some rats around town. It makes me happy for some reason. There's no such thing as a small rat problem. There's just going to be more of them. Hope springs. Rats multiply. Cute. We literally sell rat poison. They're going down. We'll see. Hey, speaking of nothing, how good is your car? Good how? Like, can it drive real far? Mate, do you know anything about... What? We should like do a road trip. To where? Out west. It gets all flat. Then it does. We can go where it's really flat. And you can see like the world's largest pierogi. Or a museum of toy rocket ships. Or a factory where they make pretzels. Or a house that looks like a big chicken. I could. Okay, let's talk about it next year. I'll start planning it now. Thought you couldn't leave home because of your issue. Eh. Yeah home enough. I mean, if we're trapped here together, we might as well be trapped out there together. I mean, if we're not dead by then. You have a way of making Doom sound like a lot of fun, Mayday. That's actually kind of a gift. God damn this door! I think God already has. There they are! Hey, guys. What's up, nerds? you who are the nerds. What? Jeez, we've never been so insulted. Take it right back, dork. Fat chance. Hey, Greg, so... I don't really know Casey. Yeah. Yeah. I just wanted to say I'm really sorry. Yeah. Thanks. Casey's a good one. 
Casey was good. Should we like tell his parents? No, I mean tell them what? Yeah. Okay, yeah. Huh. Good point. So like, what do we do? About Casey? No, like in general. Can we think about this tomorrow? Can we just play a song and get a pizza? I don't think song and pizza is an answer, really. Can we just be normal for like one day? I don't know how today can possibly feel normal. When I was down there last night, I like made the decision not to die, or at least not to die without a fight, and the thing down there told me nothing would save me forever. Wait, it was like talking to you? It's been talking to me for a long time. I just didn't know what it was. But anyway, like, nothing is going to save us forever, but a lot of things can save us today. That's really pretty, May. Thanks, I totally made it up. Like, right on the spot last night. I said it before, you're good with Doom. Doom, Doom, Doom. So anyway, song and pizza. We earned it by still being alive for another day. That's a decent reason. Decent. Decent. Let's do it. Decent. Yeah! Oh, that was so good! I want to know if I can kiss B. I gotta look that up after this, now that I know everything. Now that I've beaten this. I demand it. I demand be able to... I demand it. This was a great game. This was absolutely fantastic, and I'm so happy it exists. I don't know what else to say, so I'm just gonna... So, so unless something pops up after the credits, I hope you guys have a lovely day, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.